stakeholders are all over the country without jobs, without any engagement. Some have gone even to do masters thinking they will get a job. There are even PhD holders without jobs. And the point is we are missing in this country is it is not the paper qualification that matters today. Maybe in the past, but today what matters is what your hands can deliver. It is the skills that matter. And that's why the motto of the MBTE is now skills, not degrees. Mm -hmm. In other words, let us focus on training Nigerian youth to acquire relevant skills needed locally, and that can even be exported. Globally, the whole trend is changing towards skills. The CV that we know conventionally, you put education. Today, now they are asking you put, to put a section on skills. Mm -hmm. What skills have you acquired? Because it's not the paper that matters. Jelani Aliyu, when he went to the U.S. after finishing HND in, in, in uh, Berlin Kebi, they didn't ask for his degree or whatever. They asked, they, they tested his skills. He got some extra training and he performed very well. He was able to design the Chevrolet and many other, you know, uh, you know car designs that brought him out to the world. And Nigeria was able to bring him back home to, to, de to develop that sector. So it is the skills that matter. And parents should have a change of attitude as far as, you know, this issue of paper qualification is concerned. We have done this for so long. It has not yielded any results. We, ha we have ended up with hundreds of thousands of youth graduating every year with degrees, no jobs. And the industries are there looking for skilled labor. I will give you examples.